Um, it, there have been aspects of it that have been extremely challenging, um, especially uh, episode 112 because of the, uh, the preponderance of, of action sequences and the amount of, uh, the amount of special effects that we had to use. It was uh, time consuming and, and we didn't have any extra time uh, devoted to the episode so it had to be completed in, in, uh, in seven days and you had numerous storylines that were being wrapped up and, and, a, and a great deal, like I said, a great deal of action sequences. So that, that was very demanding, uh, especially because a lot of it was exterior. Uh, in both episodes there were a lot of exterior uh, scenes and we were shooting at a time of year where you didn't have a, a, a great deal of extra light. Uh, when we were shooting episode 104, it was right in the dead of winter, so the sun was going down at 4.30 in the afternoon. So we were racing and praying a lot of the time to uh, make sure we could get done the day's work. So th that was challenging. Um, the level of cooperation and collaboration and the, the, uh, the, the the freedom to kind of uh, discover uh, scenes and and uh, and follow my own impulses around stuff and let the actors follow their impulses uh, made things in certain ways less challenging because it was just a very uh, encouraging environment to work in. True, I mean you take characters created by Elmore Leonard and uh, the brilliant writing of. Uh, Graham Yost and uh, the talents of uh, Timothy Oliphant, a, a, an actor of his caliber, and and um, it's a it's a chance to really kind of step up and get to do something. And both my experiences uh, uh, with the, the two episodes I got to do were were really extraordinary, um, very demanding. Uh, you know, shooting the show in seven days, you you have to do a lot of stuff guerrilla style and really just go for it, but. Um, it, it was a really uh, great, creative, collaborative experience and uh, very exhilarating.